The following program is a Morse Columnia production. Viewer discretion is advised. started um where's Tariq my niggas how y'all doing looks like we talking about sex today nah we ain't gotta do all that cool let's get into why toxic relationships are man this girl sucked me up like it was a milkshake bro I knew it mm-hmm <laughs> she showed out for Valentine's Day I'm telling you the sex was out the park she was better than Tracy Tracy yeah, I told you about the last session. One of my best women's? Nah, that was Sinead. No, I, I inquired to be Robin. I swore he said Cherokee. Terry, these guys just named a basketball starting five. You gotta chill with this. You're starting to get OCD with this stuff. Listen, man, I got it under control. I didn't even take my second phone on the date with me. It was just me and my baby. Oh, that sounds very good. Huh, but trust me, it doesn't compare to the substantial weekend that me and my ivory princess had. God damn it. Substantial. How was it? Well, due to COVID, we kept our ceremony very minimal. Hmm. <laughs> Sounds like money is low. Shut up, whore! I'm, my apologies. Um, me and my uh, lovely wife, um, we stayed in uh, due to COVID. And, uh, you know, I broke out the bottle of Pere uh, you know, champagne. Uh, we watched a month of our marathon favorite show, Frasier, and thank God, uh, we had catering. Uh, you know, we tasted the finest delicacies of French cuisine. It was spectacular. Well, that's good. It feels very refreshing to hear about the fruits of your loyalty. Oh, the role play is even better. Now, um, there's this thing I do where I dress up as Nat Turner, um, and you know, before I leave the brigade that gets slavery, um, you know, the hot white mistress runs out of the plantation house and, and stops me before I create this outstanding act. You know, Missy, Miss Madeline, you was gonna get me in troubles with Mister. Then she throws me in Master's bed, right? Okay, everybody's getting uncomfortable. <clears throat> Dude, can I share my V-Day experience? You better get it. Huh? What? Uh, sorry. Go ahead. So big. I took her out to the Key Glock concert this Saturday. Hey, oh, 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 she was like, ooh, take a picture of me and Big Lock. Key, put the VVS's in the shot. You know what she said? What? She said, me and my boyfriend listen to your music all the time. He play your music while I'm at work. Nigga, you gonna top him off at this point too? And you felt it was disrespectful? Hell yeah. She looking at this nigga like he ran with Wakanda or some shit. Well, well, um, I, I kind of know a way you can fix the lusting of your woman. Um, it's this online website called LinkedIn, and they have these things called jobs. Man, whatever, man. But on Sunday, oh man, Sunday, I went all out for it. I got her this little ring light joint, you know what I'm saying? I even got her this Fing Beauty lingerie joint, too. No. You know what really took the cake, y'all boys? What, what? I ain't come on the PS5 the whole day. No, young boy? Oh my God. I 
so proud of me. I mean, I mean you. I'm so proud of you. It seems like you made really good progress. You took your own significant other on a nice day and you paid for the concert. Pay? Nah, man, that was a steaming blessing us, my boy. You really had me there. You really had me going. You got me in the first half. Uh, Darius, how was your Valentine's Day? Man, I had me some good packages. Pause! Nah, bro, no, 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 bro. It's all part of the business. I had Valentine's Day offers, bro. You got the silver sentimental, the gold gift, the platinum package, and the most expensive, the diamond debonair. The diamond debonair? For the small price of $1,000, you get five red bouquets, $200 in the cash share from the deposit, of course. But then, you also get one picture with me, blur it out, and the people on IG ain't gotta even worry about what you got going on. Then I take you to Root Chris for a nice steak dinner, and you're gonna have at least five orgasms. Well, how many orders did you have? Man, about 13. No, Kizzy? You say Bone ain't got none on me. Y'all hired? Man, see, you inside the box, but you need to be outside the box. I need you to write that down and stick it somewhere. Okay, let's focus for a second. Is this sex that you're having with all of these women unprotected, or are you using a condom? Of course I'm using condoms. I'm sleeping with multiple women on a daily basis. Good, good to hear. Of course, I require a negative STD test before anything happens. Of course, you know, before the raw smackdown. Darius, I understand this is your job, but you have to slow down with this stuff. Having sex with multiple partners like that, this can affect you both spiritually and mentally. Fucking Joe Olstein. I'm sorry, what? Nothing, Pastor. Darius, you and Tyreek are showing signs of hypersexuality disorder. This basically means that y'all have to have sex with anything that moves. Mm. Or, we just like fucking bad bitches. You ain't never had a bad bitch give you slow hair while looking you in the eyes? Mm. Mm. Yeah. Uh, you ever had your woman in cowgirl position and she rides you and she grips it while she's riding you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or, when you hit it from the back, and she look back at you and say, give me my son? Yes, sir. Okay. <laughs> um, have y'all ever busted neck and she kept going? Okay. Okay, yeah. 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 About when you beating that shit up and she moved her hands like she in special ed class. Oh, yeah. 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 What about when you eating her, her in and out, right? And you hit it with that two finger twist. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. The best part when it's your turn to take it, and then she pull out the seven inch scrap on with the vegan loop. Oh my god, and then handcuff you to the bed, bent over with the ball in your mouth. Oh my god, right, guys? <laughs> guys, so uh, <clears throat> none, none of y'all ain't no look, there is. None of your woman? Nah, bruh. Shorty had to die, bruh. Well, Alan, your girl is white. She ain't never actually- Hey, 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 on the hood, you got me fucked up, my nigga. <laughs> Listen, don't judge me. Carl, I, I'm not gonna judge you, but it explain, it explains. But... Forget all that. Well, me and my girl did it. No! We're not gonna skip over like you didn't just say that, bro. Matter of fact, we are. That's it. That's just disrespectful. Just... Oh. So, uh. Carl, I'm a professional psychologist. I'm here to listen to your problems and not judge you regardless of what you practice in the bedroom. I. Thank you. With that being said, uh, man to, let's say man, you have to put your foot down and not your ass up. Now go ahead and get out of here. I'm about to order some comfort food.
Oh, 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 oh,